Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner. I found this at the Dollar Tree and it's been a while since I had this. And I know that this was something that was really big back, seems like when I was a little in the 70s. I used to Usually I would get it at Christmas time, I'd get it in my stocking or I don't know, once in a while I'd, I'd find it from the store. And I think it's changed a little bit since I kind of remember it. They've had a little bit of things. I They've kind of changed the whole um, look of the package. And <laughs> this one's kind of fun. They had a lot of different bubble gums back from a long time ago. The bazooka, um, Hubba Bubba, Bubblicious, um, all big red, all the different ones, bubble Bubblegum, Big League Chew. Tried a lot of those ones. And this one was really unique. This Fruit Stripe Gum. You guys remember? And the little Fruit Stripe Zebra. I don't know what his name was. I'm trying to remember. I don't know if they if he had a name or I don't know. If he did, I don't remember it. And it says, um, five juicy flavors. Tattoos inside. Collect all ten. Wet them and wear them. Yipes. In action. Oh, maybe that was him. Yipes. I believe his name was Yipes Stripes. And that was the little... The little... Zebra. Yeah, that was Yipes Stripes. Five flavors. Now, if I remember right, each one has different color. There was like red, yellow, green, and orange. I don't know, but I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. I'll see if it remembers what what it was. It's been a long time since I had these. I mean, like, had to have been 30 years at least. And now these are different. Okay, they are different. Okay, yeah. There we go. See now, it's got green, red orange, yellow, and then I guess a pink. So it must be cherry, strawberry, lemon, orange, and lime. And it seems like I, I remember the packages used to be a little different. Get one of these pieces out of here. Uh, all right. Oh, okay, here we go. It says tattoos are inside, but I wonder if... Oh, yeah, here we go. Well, I'm going to take this. <laughs> All righty, Dighty. Now, they used to have stripes. They used to be different. There's a typical piece of gum, and it looks like, okay, each one is wrapped up with this tattoo on it. Okay, these are different. So they used to just be the stripes. They didn't have all this. It says there's a joke in here or activity. All right. Oh, moisten. Tattoo slightly. Okay, so yeah, here we go. This is new. Tattoos, I guess you moisten. It says moisten, moisten skin slightly. Use hint the hand lotion. <laughs> Use hand lotion. Place tattoo color side down. Press for 15 seconds. Peel off slowly. <laughs> ah, well, let's. I don't know. Here's a piece of gum, and here we go. This is green, and I don't know. I think they, they used to have the little packages used to have the stripes of the color of the gum, but here we go. Here's a typical fruit stripe gum, and yeah, what the heck. Oh, wow. <laughs> Uh 
know if that's lemon or lime. I believe it's lime. Let's see if I can find the other one. I guess each one's got a tattoo, so. And this one's red or pink. Maybe this is bubble gum or strawberry. I'm going to strawberry. Okay, here's another tattoo. No, wait a minute. This is green, too. All right. Why is everything different colors? Hmm. Here's a snowboarder. Kind of like I remember it. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and do this tattoo thing. Got a little piece of ice. Moisten my hand slightly. Okay. I'm going to put the tattoo. On there. Mm -hmm. Well, let's see. Okay. <laughs> Fifteen seconds. Let's see. <laughs> it sort of did it. I think I had too much water, but okay. Yeah. Kind of see it there. <laughs> I think it will wear off eventually. Okay, so I remember getting fruit stripe gum mostly for... Christmas time, Mama put in my stocking, stocking stuffers, candy canes, fruit stripe gum, maybe sometimes bubble, bubblelicious, bubba, hubba, bubba. Also, they had the Wrigley's spearmint gum or the double mint gum. That was kind of the ones um, that I used to get. Okay, so here's like. This one is yellow. I don't know if it's yellow or if it's just misleading. Okay, and I'm gonna. Okay, this one is yellow. Doesn't have as many stripes on this one. And I don't think. This is really bubble gum because it's not like the other one where you can really blow bubble with it. It's just fruit gum. Kind of reminds me of what you used to get. It's in the little packlets like, um, I want to say chiclets or... One was in a little pack. It's like the blister packs. You pop it out. I want to say it was like... Um, I can't remember the brand of it, but... Pop, pop it out. Like, you know, the cough drops and stuff used to be on those little blister packs. And... Yeah, kind of cool that 
now they have tattoos on them. And there you go. It's a little bit of a fun thing to do. I don't know I got these. It seems like the packs were a lot bigger, like for Christmas time. They might have been like, you know, two packs, like bundled together, big mega pack. Then you'd have gum for days. <laughs> but I do remember that. That was something I really did. Uh, I did try. What's that different? I mean, very unique. <clears throat> it doesn't seem to have the same flavor that it did back then. A lot more fruity, a lot more um, flavorful. And I think they, they tamed down the amount of sugar. Can't really taste much gum flavor to it. So, I mean, it was fun to go back and check these out again. I like the addition of the new tattoos to it. Before it was just a clever striped gum and the little mascot, the yipe striped gum uh, mascot. <laughs> and I don't know, he didn't do much. He was just in the car, the commercials. Now they're kind of making him into an extreme sports kind of guy. Skateboarding, hang gliding. Um, whatever else, but now, if you remember the Yipe Stripe mascot, leave in the comments down below, and maybe you remember these things from when you were little, or a different kind of gum, maybe like Double Mint, um, they had, um, was it Beeman's, old one, Blackjack, some of those old gum back from way back in the day. Wrigley Spearmint, Double Mint, Juicy Fruit, that's another one, kind of along the same line. And these weren't the best, but, you know, every once in a while, Got to go back and relive your childhood. Try some of the stuff that you remember from when you were little, especially if it's available today. Um, like I said, go in the Dollar Tree. They've got a lot of the old classic candies that are still around, you know, like the classic candy bars, the old time candy. So if you want to kind of relive some of your childhood memories and you go, wait a minute, I haven't had one of those in like 20 years. Well, go on down there and give them one a try. Maybe you find something that uh, you totally forgot about. So, hope you're enjoying this series of me going back and revisiting my classic candies from my childhood. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over there. That way you won't miss any future content, or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I will be going over some classic candy for you guys. I'm going to put these away. <laughs> I'll have to wash the tattoo off. But, um, yeah, if I get a little hankering for some fruit striped gum and I want to get a little uh, wacky and wild, I'll give them a try. So, until next time, I'll talk to you guys later.